Hey guys, what's up? By Sectatron here from One Hive Gazette. Here with the next video, this is a live attack video, Town Hall 11. Uh, first, we have a special guest. I'd like to welcome my roommate, Boostatron. What's up, guys? Boostatron in the house. Give this man 60K. Let's go. Big boosted board guy. Uh, check out his Instagram. It is Ethan underscore YK. Uh, comment on his photos telling him where you're from, that you saw him on the channel. I really appreciate it. I'll link his Instagram in the description below as well. Anyway, um, that's the price you pay for recording in a dorm room, I guess. <laughs> uh, here we go with this attack. I'll go through the plan. It is an 11v11, and I know some of you guys are wanting to see some of that 10v10 action, so uh, that's just, you know, I'll try to switch back and forth. But for now, uh, we're going to do another 11 one because I'm having some fun on the 11 here. Um, the plan is this. I'm going to do Electro Dragons on this base. Um, I'm going to basically put uh, a giant in the wall wrecker, or not the wall, sorry, that was the old plan. I'm putting down the uh, battle blimp to go here and just destroy this area. I'm going to put down like a test loon and a baby dragon to help finish off the archer towers and wizard tower in case the balloons don't track back nicely. Um, I'll check the CC radius as well, we'll have to look at that. Um, over here, it's going to be uh, wizard, uh, king, wizard, wall break here, also a few giants to tank. Um, so open that up, and um, king should be able to get most of that compartment taken out. And then finally the queen back here. I might drop her a little bit later if I can, um, so she can stay alive, but she's going to take out this area. Send in the E-Dragons with the Warden here, have a bunch of Rages, a Freeze or two. Might have to freeze this Inferno. Um, I'm going to have a Haste here for those Balloons. And then finally, send in the last group with a Haste. It'll be tough to get to that back end air defense with the Sweeper pushing everything away, which is why I'm going to have like five Loons and a Haste to get that air defense, then kind of come over for whatever's left. Um, try to make sure that the Queen does not aggro those Balloons. The Dragons should close in at about the same time. So a little bit of a complicated plan. We'll look at it in game and try to get an idea. Um, the lights are changing colors in front of me, which is why it looks weird, but um, that's just the feature of the room, I guess. Um, so anyway, like I said, I'll get some more Town Hall 10 live attacks. Do not worry about that. But um, I thought, you know, I'm about to attack on the 11. Might as well get this one recorded and uploaded. Um, check the army comp. Looks like I have everything I wanted to. Um, I took some, one of the guys' ideas in the comments about bringing two max freezes and then the rage of my own. That way I've, I have all max spells instead of bringing my own freezes which aren't maxed. Um, so that was a good idea. Appreciate that. Bringing two freezes anyway. Um, checking the range here, I, I don't necessarily want to lure out the CC in case it's a small CC. So I think what we'll do is... Um... We'll start the king first. We'll go king here, or king there rather, wizard, wizard, um, giants, one or two giants I think. How many do I have? Two? Okay, we'll do two. Two giants to tank this, wall break in, then as soon as like the wall break is done, I'll do the blimp. So everything happens at the same time. The CC can come out, I just don't want it to mess with my king. Uh, the dragons can take care of it I think, and I have a poison as well obviously. So that all being said, um, let's go ahead and um, actually I want to bring a goblin, not an archer. Small thing, but um, it can take out the town hall. Put it right there at the beginning, you know, take out a t the town hall by the end of the attack. So it's the little things that add up, you know. All right, let's turn the music up as we get just about ready to go in here. Got the air warden, that's important. To haste. All right, here we go. Music is up a little bit, and uh, we will start with the goblin, then the king, wizards, giants, wall breakers. Goblin, king, wizard, wizard, giant, giant. Uh, troll test that will drop a balloon on it. Wall breakers didn't work. That's unfortunate to say the least. I'm um, not sure how they died there. Alright, let's do the battle blimp. Blimp. 
this haste down. Balloon, baby dragon. One more balloon. Should take all of that out. Got the CC lured. All right, let's start these electro drags. This guy just has all kinds of troll Teslas. We're gonna go ahead and use the queen in a little bit of a different location, I think. We'll hold on to these three balloons. Use the queen here. Rage up here. Freeze here. Got all those ground skellies, didn't even see that. That's really unfortunate. Um, Warden ability. We have to pop the queen here. Rage both these groups up. And we'll freeze the air sweeper and the air defense. And then we'll use these three loons where we see fit, I guess. Maybe haste into here. Not sure if that really got a whole lot of value. Um, the queen is still alive somehow. I think that goblin is actually still alive. Um, oh, I still have a rage? Jeez, this attack is just insane. I'm going to save the rage for the other E-Dragon. I'm not sure how many hit points it has left. If, if it's close to full, I might have a good chance, actually. Um, I honestly don't know. So we got this rage. Please have a lot of hit points, Mr. E-Dragon. This has been a terrible attack, by the way, but whatever. Let's get the rage down here so the Electro Dragon hops up into it. Okay, it has no hit points. Perfect. Um, man, like one shot, because these two... That would have just taken everything out. That is a very close, very poorly executed attack, but um, Town Hall 11, there's actually a lot of room for error, surprisingly enough. We'll take a look at the replay, then we'll wrap this thing up. Um, that's too bad. Uh, I mean, if the king, if the wall breakers didn't fail, this one I think would have easily tripled. Um, but let's let's take a look at it and see. So, um, what happened? I kind of dropped the giant. He started walking over to the archer tower, so I waited on the wall breakers, and then they just got destroyed by the bomb towers. I, I don't know. Should have tanked differently. Just sloppy wall breakers. Um, pretty much no value from the king. Uh, fast forward a little bit battle blimp goes down this guy was rocking like all kinds of troll teslas too it was crazy um just a very poor sloppy attack but almost triple just goes to show that you know town hall 11 has a surprising amount of room for error um anyway some witches come out all that kind of stuff um drop down the loons on uh troll tesla there warden um Everything moving in here. I decided to go ahead and use the queen uh, over here, and I had to use her ability. It was really close here. We'll see the dragons moving through. Um, went ahead and froze the inferno. Then right here, there's all these skellies on her. If there was like something to help her out, maybe like a wizard, I probably would have been able to save her ability. I definitely had to use it, but um, having her ability later probably would have helped get the three star there. And then from here, these dragons just sit in the middle of the base. Um, went ahead and raged up both groups. You can see how nicely the bounces are. I mean, if the buildings are close together, they get some nice uh, splash bounces. So I think a pretty good f uh, freeze on the sweeper air defense there. And then at this point, it's just these last few dragons can't quite do it. Maybe should have raged up again right here. Um, yeah, I don't know. You can see how low all these defenses were. Just one, like literally one or two shots would have done it. But um, anyway, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching. Check out that link in the description for sure. And um, I will see you guys later. Bisectatron out.